guys, my name is Elena, I'm a graphic designer and this is my channel for beginners in Adobe Illustrator and in graphic design. And today I'm going to show you 5 ways to make a shadow without a Gaussian blur. If you're interested, keep watching! Okay guys, let's start our tutorial. At first we need rectangle tool, hold shift and draw this square. Okay, now select the black and white gradient. Here we need this color and here this color. Now select gradient tool and make like me. Now we need to select this color and rounded rectangle tool. Here we need this option, here this, and here this radius. OK. Now move it here. Now let's draw here our design. We need rectangle tool with these options ok and one more rectangle with these options ok now select this rectangle and put it here now copy and paste this and put it here make it a little longer okay now copy and paste this one and put it here okay now copy and paste this one move it here make it a little smaller like this now copy and paste this one and move it here and last one this one copy and paste and put it here now select all shapes and align them now pathfinder and unite now select direct selection tool and make like me you see here ok and here we need to fix our rounded corners select these and these points and round it select these and these points and round it and the same here and here and the last time here Okay, now it's good. Now we need to create one more rectangle with these options. Okay, and put it here. And now copy and paste this one, make the copy smaller, put it here, and now select both make this smaller, this a little up, select both and align them. Now direct selection tool and rounded corners. OK. Now we need here black color. Select all. Uh, sorry, but at first group this and now Align, OK. Make our design a little smaller and move here. Now select this and group, select white rectangle and design and align it. 
okay now select this and liner gradient here we need this color and here we need this one and gradient tool and let's play a little with a gradient Okay, now let's lock our background, go to the layers and here is our background and we need to lock it. Now first way to create a shadow. Select this, copy and paste. Now send to backward. Select this gray color and move it a little down and to the right. And here we need opacity multiply. Okay, first shadow is ready. Now the second one. Select this shadow and okay, select it and select black and white gradient here these degrees and here we need more lighter gray color here this color and now i like the shadow it's you can play with these options Okay, third way, select again this shadow and select, for example, this gray color. You can select yours gray color. Here we need multiply and object, create gradient mesh, here 4 and here 4. Okay, and now we need to add white color to these points okay you can stay it like this or you can make the shadow a little bigger you can add the white color here okay and the same here okay guys this shadow is ready now the fourth one select this shape effect drop shadow and here you can change options as you like now you see I changed options like this and shadow changed. It became more smoother. Also you can play with the color here. For example, you can select this color. I think it's more pretty. Or you can change opacity, you see, okay, also you can select for, for example green color and the same if you change opacity it will be different effect. I select this color I think it more pretty okay now the last one the fifth way to make shadow we need to create black rectangle tool 
a sort of black rectangle and rotate it 45 degrees move it like me now we need here a little fix it okay now this bring to front and this one make a little longer like this and now black and white gradient here we need opacity zero and here opacity multiply okay and select the gradient tool and move like me like this and you can play with the shadow with the help of this slider like this or like this okay guys that's all for today hope you like my tutorial if yes give me a like and subscribe and see you in the next videos about a graphic design and in the next tutorials in adobe illustrator bye bye guys Mwah.